morning to you ladies, my name is Jack Septicain, Zoocosis! Rescue the animals. I think this game is about you're a zoo operator, you're trying to do stuff with animals, the animals are all kinds of messed up, mutated weirdos. Who am I to judge? I look like a mutated animal most of the time. Thanks to the devs for sending out a code early so I could play it. The game's not even out yet. That's exciting. New game. Don't crash. Before we begin, I want you to put down your scribble. That wasn't John Goodman, was it? <laughs> that sounded an awful lot like John Goodman. Paul Connolly. I wrote cum. Excellent. You made the right move. Just a couple more things and you'll pull your family out of poverty. I really hope so. It's not him. Attach this to your chest. Our scientists require us to do this to see everything that happens in the enclosures. Scientists? I thought this was a zoo. True. Never thought that the smart Alex belong right in the zoo. <laughs> Hope you got the joke. Excellent. Now let's get started. I didn't. First, grab your personal PDA. It's necessary for interacting with all the work objects. Congratulations, you've taken the first step to becoming a part of our close-knit zoo family. Wait, what's this for? He'll find out later. Dude! Worst job interview! I mean, at least I got the job, but the things you do for less than minimum wage these days. Because let's face it, you're probably not paying me minimum wage. Oh, are you finally awake? Good. Get up. <laughs> it's time to get to work. That's Skyrim referenced. What did you do to me? I took care of your health. Working with animals requires prevention. You wouldn't want to bring some kind of infection home, would you? By the way, I took your phone as well. I'll return it in the morning after the shift. So I got the job? I thought we had an interview. My wife is waiting for me outside. The job will be yours if you make it through the night. Let's go. I still have a lot to show you. Okay. But what about my wife, though? <clears throat> cool. Oh. Is this the PDA thing showing me what I can interact with? Come on, John Goodman! Give me access! I deserve it! I'm a good lad! I work hard, even though I haven't worked a single second yet. Oh. My. God. <laughs> Who wants to go to the bathroom in here? It looks like someone exploded. Ugh, <sighs> oh, I have allergy things all up in my nose and it's annoying me. Ugh. <sighs> allergy gag, rise up. There are dozens of us! Brick trolley. Okay. I don't even really know what the main gameplay loop in this game is. I think I just feed animals and look at them and whatever. I just saw really cool messed up animals in the trailer and I was like, well, I'm going to play that immediately. Come on, we're not playing here. It's quite spacious here. Yep, this is our hub. You'll have plenty of everything here, except time. Now we're in the cold room. Here we store herbs, vegetables, and fish while the meat gets ground into portions for the animal rations. Mm. And right now we're running low on herbs and vegetables. Got the hint? Get to it. You can find the instructions in your PDA. Brother, you're sh throwing a whole bunch at me. Ah! Load two herbal and one vegetable bricks into the brick trolley. Two herbal... What? I already forgot. Oh, I can only do one at a time. Herb! I've aged even more waiting for you here. John Goodman, shut up! I'm trying my best, okay? I'm giving these animals weed. Um, what was it? Two herbal and one vegetable. Okay. What are we feeding? Most of the bricks will be left as a reserve. And take these ones with you. It's time to show you our workhorse. Okay. Whoa! What was that? There's something in the works that you're not ready to know about yet. Let's start with the basics. I don't like how normal you're being about this. Okay, start with the basics. Do I take this? And here's our K-A-T-I-E. Kinetic Automated Transport with Innovative Engineering. Katie will take you around the zoo. Okay. Oh, I put this in here. This is the refrigeration compartment. You need to load the brick trolley here. 
Until you load it here, Katie won't budge. To load the brick trolley, you need to activate the lever. Okay, that's kind of cool. Aboard. Now select the giraffe enclosure on the control panel and start the train. The giraffe enclosure. Was that a giraffe I just heard? I'm gonna tell you, John Goodman, I haven't met many giraffes in my life, but none of them sound like that. Oh my god, what are you- are you mewing? Dude's got, like, bruxism from doing too much cocaine. There's so many monitors! Which one do I do it on? Control panel. This is not what I would have expected, but okay. Giraffe. We have wallabies, gorillas, penguins, zebras, moose, hippopongamus. Is Moodang in here? And an elephant. That, if you don't know who Moodang is, look up Moodang. It's the best. And judging by when you watch this video, you could be watching this video a thousand years in the future. Wudang's long gone. Fasten your seat belts and sit up straight. Let's go. I highly doubt there's any seat belts in this fucking thing. Wow. Here we go into Rapture. Are you Andrew Ryan? Hold on. <laughs> Can't see anything. I like that I'm seeing through my body cam. So we're at the giraffe station. Now listen carefully, I won't repeat it twice. This is our mobile veterinary station. Here you'll be mixing medication for our animals. Okay. Are they sick? Well, they can be. We need to closely monitor the health of the animals. We have some quite rare specimens, so the thought of anything happening to them is out of the question. Take this seriously and we should all be safe for another day. You got Follow it. Me. This is our kitchen factory. To collect feces for tests, you have to feed the animal its favorite food. Here's where you'll prepare it. Choose the recipe from the list. Cut, mix, and you're done. Any questions? Yes. Several hundred. Excellent. The <laughs> zoo needs those who aren't afraid to ask. But even more so, it needs those who find answers themselves. Great. <laughs> All right, enough chit-chat. Go to the cutting table. Okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ, these tools. <laughs> Rusty. This is like what people dismember somebody in a Saw movie with. You need to select the giraffe from the list. Okay. Let him cook, baby! Click on the cut button to slice herbs. Don't make a mistake with the weight. The exact measurement is displayed on the weight indicator. Measure carefully. Okay. Do I... Okay, I'll cut a little bit off? It's not enough, Paul. Add more. How do I know? It's six, so... Do I need the 3.5 to be over here or over here? I don't know. It's not enough, Paul. Excellent, Paul. In the Cut. Now do the same with the herbal brick from the recipe. Go ahead. You deviate from the recipe 6% of 20%. So does that mean I did good? Like anything over 20% and it's not usable? I need something to measure things quantitatively. We have that technology. 1.5 kilos. Oh my god, ratatouille. It's not enough, Paul. Add more. 10% of 20%. This is so confusing. I don't know. I think the amount that's left in the middle of the table is how much I need. I don't know. Oh, it's 10% total. I was going to say, 20% off is... <laughs> That's almost a quarter wrong per brick. Perfect. Now activate the lever to lower the gadget trolley. Okay. This is I'm sure this will make sense as we go, but this is very confusing. Oh, there it goes. Now drag the trolley to the gates. Well done, Katie. You got it, John Goodman. I loved you in the borrowers. And as Fred Flintstone. This is like Five Nights at Mutated Crazy Zoo. Hmm. Salamander, cut off its tail. Your grip strength will grow. I never thought a zoo could be organized like this. A train, trolley. Look at him yes, walk. Well, our zoo is quite unique. It's our pride. You won't see anything like it in others. Pride? Then why is the zoo been closed for the second year? People say the zoo is going through tough times. How would I know? I'm just a simple man. Clock in and clock out. How long have you been working here? Long enough to teach you everything. Come on, move the trolley. 
I am. What do you mean? Stop bounding at me like that. To open the door, you need to insert your PDA into the enclosure terminal and select open enclosure. Insert my penis. Okay. New note added. Zucosis. I have to observe the behavior of animals. Zucosis can manifest itself in strange actions and weird movements of animals. Oh my god. Is this going to get really complicated where I have to like spot things? Because I'm not going to be good at that. So Zucosis is, uh, is like an abnormality. Scars. So Zucosis is a brain thing. Scars manifest as scars. Okay. I looked at the zoo DVD logo. Welcome to the giraffe enclosure. Bo, Poe, and Cleo. So we have a temperature, a sound, hydration, and food poop. Oh, it says it down here. Blood. Feces, frequency, and temperature. Careful where you're wagging that fucking thing. Hey guys! Cleo! Oh, they're so cute! Here you go! Oh god, okay. That's actually terrifying. Where do I put the food? I don't remember what you said! I was too busy! Pet him. Oh, pretty giraffe. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh god. Isn't, you know how we're like, oh, dinosaurs don't exist anymore. Like, oh, we have our normal creatures now. It's like, are you kidding me? Have you seen giraffes? These are as close to a brontosaurus as we're going to get. What do I do? <laughs> Pour the food into the feeding area. Okay. What the hell is the feeding area? Is this a feeding area? What did I do? I don't know what I'm doing! I'm sorry guys, I want to feed you and I don't want you to kill me! Oh, it says it over here. Feeding area. That's good. Oh, lovely slop! Nom nom slop? Everybody like yummy disgusting soup? Giraffes are so bizarre. You couldn't put it a little higher for them. <laughs> even, even for BB, we have like a little thing that we can put a bowl into to make it higher. You not hungry? Nom nom? Oh, that's playing sounds. I thought it was an animal. That's good, right? <gasps> he pooped. Should I pick up the poop? Okay, I need something to collect the poop. Let me go back to John Goodman. What do I do next? <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? Work in progress. Feed, measure, analyze, collect. But how do I collect? Can I collect in this same bucket? No, I'm not allowed. Return the bucket to the gadget trolley. Okay, maybe I should just pay attention to my objectives. Maybe that'll get me through it. There's a lot of information to take in at first, but we'll get it eventually. Great. Now put on the MFE. What's that? Mobile fecal extractor. In simpler terms, a shit sucker. <laughs> You've eaten shit before. <laughs> now you're going to suck it. I don't know. Why do we need all this? We need to constantly monitor the health of the animals, and taking excrement for tests is one of your key tasks. A hundred thousand a year, Paul. A hundred thousand fucking American dollars. You just have to collect the shit. Should I collect Come you as well? Because you're acting like shit. Out. What do you mean? You've eaten shit before, now you have to suck it. John Goodman, I'm gonna have to ask you what you do in your spare time. Fuck a stranger in the ass, Larry! I, for sure, I'm not eating shit. Poop sucker, here we go! I gotta see what's wrong with you. Collect. It's not letting me collect it. Oh, I hated everything about that. Hey, Paul, what's up? 
Oh, because they were close to it. Oh my god, the sound is legitimately going to make me gag. Return the MFE to the gadget trolley. You got it. You want to sniff, John Goodman? You want to sniff my shit, sucker? Here you go. Yeah, sniff it. Sniff it. Taste it. Taste it, John Goodman. You just oh. saved my life. Now take the TIS. To avoid unnecessary questions, it's a thermal imaging system. You can just call it a thermal imager. It's needed to determine the body temperature of our animals. Okay, take the TIS. Good. Now install it and measure the temperature of the giraffes. Measure the temperature of all giraffes. Do I... Enable. Oh. Oh. Whoa. 38.6. You're gonna be just fine. What are you at? 38.8. You're perfect. I just realized that it said we're in, like, the 90s. Oh, they're sleeping. They're so cute when they're fucking weird. Yeah, September 6, 1991. 42.2. John, that's a little high, don't you think? He's sick. That's why he's sleeping. I gotta go report my findings to John Goodman. When you're there, grab those two. Uh, you were saying stuff when I wasn't there. What the fuck were you talking about? As you can see, one of the giraffes isn't doing well. We need to make a dart with Temperalax. It's a medication for normalizing the temperature of animals. By the way, it was developed by one of the local eggheads. Interact with the terminal and press the exit and closure button. Okay. I gotta go make it? In the terminal, you can check all the analyses you've collected in this enclosure. So I can't, I can't do it yet because I didn't bring it in with me. Make some medications too. Well, you studied chemical technology in Indiana. You'll manage. Damn. How do you know all this? Trust me, it's not something worth being surprised about here. But I barely lasted six months there. I got kicked out in the first year. No worries. That should be enough to mix a couple of ingredients following a ready-made formula. Move faster, John. Move faster, John. Do I have to? Okay. So every day I go out, do I have a specific? Enclosure of animals that I have to do or can I do any of them at any time because that's going to be a lot of them Or maybe it's more linear and we go animal by animal Congratulations, Paul. You've just come closer to success and the well-being of your family now go and load the collected fecal matter into the biomaterial receiver Don't carry anything into the car. Everything must be sterile and don't forget to put the shit sucker back in its place Okay Where does that go? Oh. Ew. 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 I like it. There's a neat kind of loop to it. Oh, Jesus, John! Now you need to load the trolley into the train. To do this, press the lever inside the car. Okay. God, he fucking scared the shit out of me. Look, it's already gonna get scary enough with the animals later. I don't need you scaring me as well. Our mobile vet station. To make Temporalax, you need to load the station with enough vials. I did it this time, but in the future, you'll have to gather the vials yourself to cook it up. But keep in mind, chum, there are not so many vials. Think twice before using them. Ugh. Is this game going to be hard? I don't have the brains for this. Okay, so we're making Temperalax. Temperalax. Okay. Create. Oh, easy. Perfect. Now take the dart from- Cool, you've got Temperalax. Now load it into the veterinary gun. It's in the gadget trolley. Okay, the veterinary gun. Oh. Ooh. Tell me, John. Are you scared? If I aim it at him, it takes it away, but are you scared, John? 
Should, should I just go shoot them? Take the vet gun and load it with the temporal lax using the PDA. Oh, did... Like, the PDA here? Okay, use. Good. Now the only thing left is to dart the sick giraffe. Okay. Do you feel lucky, John? Do you feel lucky? I can temporal axe you right in your temporal lobe. I can make you see stars, John. Sick giraffe ball. Be careful, though. What? Let me back into the enclosure. I mean, it should say it on them, right? Yeah. Oh, sick little bean. Daddy's gonna make it all better. Woo! Butt shot! You've cured all the animals. Returns at the train. <gasps> Jesus! Oh, Poe, you're back alive. You're better than ever. You can go eat and poop if you want. Is that everything? Did I do everything? Are you are you everything now? I'll pet you again. <laughs> You're not even the scary giraffe yet. They're just fucking weird. It's like someone took a cheetah, mixed it with a horse, and then stretched it out too much. Like, horses are scary enough on their own. They're, they're big. They're strong. You don't know what they're thinking, if anything at all. Now, imagine that, but four times bigger. What the fuck was that? Huh. Okay. Infection symptom. Mucus. Mucus discharge in animals is a marker of disease. There's a lot to take care of. I can't wait to see some fucked up penguins in this game. I've already seen the messed up giraffes in, like, the trailer. But I want to see the penguins. Do you think the penguins will grow two heads and try and chomp me? So everything went smoothly? Seems like it. I did this for the first time. Hopefully he'll get better soon. Well, don't doubt that. We need to get back to the hub. Okay. Um. Oh, this one. I'm getting it, John. I'm getting it. There's a lot to take in. <laughs> You're a good teacher, though. Step by step. I just wish that you would stop... Like, clenching your jaws like that. You're making me incredibly anxious. Oh, should I put the dart gun back? There you go. Do you think I'm still... Escort me to the exit. It's time to leave you alone with our lovely zoo facilities. I haven't even been here for one day. I've been here for all of 20 minutes. And you're securing the zoo with me. Um, the only thing I'm unsure about so far is this thing. I'll probably get better at it, but it's like that... There's like game shows or something where it's like... Cut the pretzel exactly in half and somebody has to measure it then afterwards. I think I would be good at that in real life, but in the game? Uh-uh. You think I'm equipped to do all of this so far, John? Every zookeeper is entitled to a service car. This one's mine. If you perform well tonight, you'll get one in the morning. Who's that? Is that a Ferrari? Wife. Should I tell her you're staying here for the night? Keep in mind, I'll lock you in until morning. Oh, it's my no wife. Problem. I think she'll figure it out and go home soon. As you wish. <laughs> Good luck, Paul. Paul! Don't mess up. Paul, you suck! Talk to your wife! She's literally right outside the door! You could just be like, hey honey, my job started now. Be safe, get home safe, darling. My wife just left! I'm a terrible husband! I hope I fucking take care of animals better than I take care of the living people. The cold room has been restocked with 20 fish bricks for the penguins. Ooh! You need to pull the lever to drop the bricks into the fridge. Okay. Um, darling, honey dearest sweetums, I love you. I'm doing this for us and our future children. My boss writes me hard, but not harder than I write you. Who is that? I entered here who knows how long ago. If you're not answering calls, I'm worried. Oh, it is my wife. Lily, sweetheart. Sorry. Didn't hear you right away. Everything's okay. They put me on probation, but I had to start immediately. You should just go home. 
I'll be back in the morning to tell you everything. Pulp, but I saw them lock you up. It's not normal. Yeah, it's just protocol here. They took away my phone and made me sign an NDA. And all I have to do is feed and treat the animals. Oh, uh, and by the way, uh, there's plenty of meat here. I want my girls to finally eat normal food. I'll be right back. Don't go away. What is happening? This is some papers, please shit. The company provides. There's plenty of meat here. It's all for animals, but my girls are gonna eat like the best penguins <laughs> that have ever existed. <laughs> um, okay, what am I doing? Check the enclosure, feed the animals, collect analyses. Put meat brick for Lily in the parcel drop box. Wait, I gotta open this, what is this? Do my darling children want chemical complex or phyto complex? No, they're already gonna have a fucking daddy complex for me feeding them cat food. I don't need to give them something else. Okay, hold on. Let me go to the other room. Oh, my... My children are gonna eat the best meat brick. Oh, I still have some left over. Um, I don't know if I'm supposed to go into this room to get it. I've been left alone in this place and I barely know how anything works or where anything is, but sure! Oh, I can sprint with it. Epic. Meat. Oh, yeah. Industrial grade brown. Oh, my kids are gonna love this. They're gonna feed like- They're gonna eat like fucking hippos for a week. <laughs> Ego! I mean, hippos don't eat meat, do they? No. Lily, are you here? Yeah. Take this. Give Gina a kiss from Daddy. It's time for me to work. <laughs> Take this industrial grade brown. Take it home for my darling kids. Don't tell them that Daddy doesn't provide, because Daddy does. Daddy provide mucho mito. Okay. Check the next enclosure. Feed the animals, collect analyses. Measure the temperature, measure the sound. So, he told me what the animals liked, but how do I find out what the next animals like? Okay, that's not for that. Like, I don't know what penguins like. What do the penguins eat? What does the fox say? Pingu. Oh, fish, right. He did say that. I need two. Does that mean I need two bricks? I'm gonna bring two bricks anyway. I do get some left over anyway, so... Can I put this back in the veggies? Ooh! Nice! Recycling! Beautiful, beautiful! Huh? Okay, we got 16 left after this. But that's good. These pingus are gonna eat so good! I'm glad I can sprint with this, because that was gonna get annoying if I have to walk really slowly every time. Okay, I'm getting it! I got it! I'm smart brain! Maybe I can be as smart as the animals! So this is six, and I need two. Oh my god, that looks disgusting. So let's see, that's two... Or, that's half, so that's three, so... You deviate from the recipe 94% of 20? Okay. Animal may refuse to eat. Okay. My bad. My bad. Okay, let me... Okay, I don't have enough to cut. <laughs> Total weight 2.1? So am I supposed to be this side then? Okay. I think that that's what that is. I think that's good. I have 0 0.1 and I need 2. So it's not that. So I ended up with the tiny little sliver that was left. I'm so fucking confused about how this works. I think I'm just being dumb about it, but... Wait, we still have a brick. There's still a brick there. Oh, I was getting confused. I thought that this is how much I had put in for the fish, but that's how much I need to make 
the food for the fish. Now I have it, so I can go to the penguin enclosure. Oh. Ooh, we can go to the wallabies and the gorillas as well. It just says go to the next enclosure. But he said for the penguin, so I just assumed I have to go to the penguins. Penguin station! Okay, um... Oh wait, I pull it inside, yeah. Oh! This is a lot to take in. Oh, whoops. Nope. I also find it a bit weird that I'm not allowed to look forward. I have to walk backwards with this. I heard something in here. Is there a phone ringing? Hello? Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Oh, thank God, finally. Uh, please don't hang up. I've been trying to reach my husband all day. He's a scientist, Clarence J. Summers. People usually call him CJ. I'm sorry, ma'am. I'm here alone. Please check for me. He should be in the lab. Uh, is there a lab here? Oh, I understand. You're new. Then, one last request. Look in his locker in the break room. Code 1768. Ma'am, this doesn't feel right. Paul, I'm begging you. CJ needs to take his medication regularly. I just want to make sure he has them with him. Just open the locker. That's all. I'll call back. 1768. Okay. I mean, that's not here, right? In the break room. You got it. A PDA. Okay. I just saw something. Horrible. I shot lethal dart, but one wasn't enough. It took around 300 milliliters, but it worked. Fuck, it worked. I'm alive. I'm not sure if I should help this woman. I already have enough problems as it is. I want to help this woman. I want to know what happened to CJ. CJ fucking dead. CJ walked in, he was like, ah, shit, here we go again. Okay. I don't think I have the right amount of food. It said that they might refuse to eat it, so we'll see. Daisy, Luna, Coco, Tinker, Misty, Rocky. Okay. Hey, guys. And within moments, their affair comes to an end. Here you go, here's some slop. Oh, Jesus. I'm sorry if you refuse to eat it, I tried my best. <laughs> Here they come. <laughs> Take your time. One by one, they all come for the food. Please eat it, please eat it. Okay, you're eating, good. Good, 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 good. Any, any pus and mucus coming out of any of you? Some of you are green, some of you are yellow, some of you are blue. I don't know much about real penguins. Is that how they all are? This is a cute enclosure you guys have got, apart from the ominous government lighting in the background. Ooh, is that, maybe that's the lab. Okay, have people pooped? Oh, maybe you puked it up. Oh god, I think they're puking it up. Oh god, I didn't give them the right food. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What does it say in here? Work in progress. Ah, oh, shit. I think I fucked it up. Oh god, they're all getting sick because of me. Oh, this is poop. That's good. That just looked like the food you ate, and you regurgitated it, but... Cool. I got some poop! Oh! More poop! Yes! I hate the mother load! My retirement grease! I mean, I'm doing what it said. I fed them, I collected feces. Just because it wasn't right. 
three little holes to sleep in. That's cute. All right, please don't kill me. Is that all the poop I can get? I think so. <laughs> okay, and now I have to measure their temperatures. Okay, everybody stay still. Stay still, stay still. Say cheese. Coco, come here. 38.9, that's good. Tinker, you're good. Daisy, you're good. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Very nice temperatures for guys that live in the ice. 38.6, you're fine. Misty, good job. <gasps> more poop. I gotta go get that poop. Hold on, I gotta measure more temps. I got you, Luna and Becky. I think you're the only two left. Or Becky, <laughs> Rocky. Coco, get out of the way. You had your turn. Okay, so everybody's good. Nobody's sick. You're unhappy with the food, though. I can fix you! I just- I don't know what I'm doing. I- I don't know what penguins like. Feed the animals. I did! Measure the sound? Submit blood for analysis? What the fuck? Hold on, I gotta get more poop. This job is asking too much of me. I'm just a, I'm just a guy. Oh! oh I want to go down that! Man, that sucks. I could have been a cool guy. Can I force them to eat? <laughs> um... ASSA? Blood syringe? I wasn't taught how to do this. Hey. Oh god. <laughs> I don't like those eyeballs of yours. Okay, enough petting now. I've pet I've pet the thing. I can't blood syringe any of them. Hold on. Oh. Woo! Is that enough? No, I pressed tab to see my things. I didn't want to put the thing away. I don't know if the blood I got is enough blood. I don't know why it... Oh, he just takes it out naturally. I don't know why I'm able to bleed that one specifically. I'll bleed you as well. I'll bleed you all. I feel like John Goodman didn't explain himself very well. I feel like there's a lot of shit that I have to do that I have no idea how to do it. I'm not equipped. I'm not ready to do this. I don't know what to do. Okay, put the blood syringe back. I don't know what the fuck this does. Check for sound? Okay, you sound good? Is that how a penguin is supposed to sound? Oh, some of you have like a little blood thing on you, but none of you- none of it's full. The sound thing is getting full, but the blood thing didn't. Oh my god, I'm killing all my penguins! Task complete. Okay, I did that one. I still didn't feed them! Oh, because I didn't submit the blood for analysis yet. Maybe I can bring it back to the cart and do that. Look, guys, I'm sorry about the food, okay? I'm not a chef. I'm a Paul. <laughs> All right, see you later, Newt Newts. This is very overwhelming. I'm getting overwhelmed and overstimulated. I can't do this. <laughs> uh, there's a reason I became a YouTuber, so I don't have to do a job like this. Too many fucking things to take care of. Where do I submit blood, though? Biomaterial receiver? Feces goes in there. A fucking millipedes go in the other one, apparently. Um. Blood syringe. What is this? Redix complex added. C cool. Where do I submit blood? Yeah. Blood collector. 
Is this all good? How many bloods did I get? I feel like I drained these poor bastards of everything. Oh, I think I'm putting empty ones in. I think it's just gonna be... I think it's just gonna do that every single time. Okay. Submit blood for analysis, submit feces for analysis, heal the animals. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what to do. So if they have reds across all of these, most of them are fine, but one of them is showing up- I mean, I didn't get poop from three of them. Tinker's red on just blood, so does that mean BSI? BSI is a condition where bacteria or other pathogens enter the bloodstream, causing serious illness. So how do I fix that? Lethal injection! I think that's how you do it. <laughs> B guard? Antimicrobial substance for the treatment of blood diseases. Yes, because I did get a redix outside. So let's let's get my redix dart. And wait, who needed it? Tinker. Okay. I sent you a parcel with vials of the active substance. I think you'll find them useful. You'll find them in the parcel box. Dude, I don't know where anything is. I barely even found the penguins. Okay, let's go back in. Tinker needs to get zapped. So I won't be able to do everything. Tinker! Where are you at, blood weirdo? Coco Chanel, Luna. Daisy. Tinker, where are you at, dog? There you are. <laughs> He's like, no, don't shoot me! I'm not going back to jail! <laughs> okay, check the next enclosure. I did it! I saved the penguins! Hallelujah! Praise the Lord! You've cured all the animals. All the animals that I know something's wrong with. Can't figure out what's wrong with them if they don't poop. the fuck? What happened? Oh, phone's ringing. What? Night zookeeper, Paul Connolly. I'm sorry, ma'am. I haven't had a chance to look around yet. What's with the ma'am? Oh, nothing. A woman called. Looking for someone named CJ. Searching for her husband. Fuck a day. That bitch again. Although CJ's no saint either, always hanging around some girls, lying to his wife that he's in the lab. And we don't even have labs here. Anyway, forget it. Why am I calling you? There'll be a food delivery soon, and you need to grind some fresh meat. Got it? Yes, sir. Mm. Excellent. I'll call you later. Okay. Cool. What am I going to check on next? Gorillas? Wallabies? I'm so excited. Um, yeah, grills and wallabies I can do. Let's go to the hall. Oh, I'm sorry if I'm all over the place with this, but <laughs> it's probably easier when you're watching it rather than playing it. But as someone playing it, there's a lot of information to take in and it's very confusing. It's fun though. I like it. I like the idea behind all of this. Wait, can I not take my gadget trolley out? Maybe I have to do it out here. Oh, right, because it's the brick trolley, not the gadget trolley. Okay. Let me put my fish back. Nice. Um, oh. Herbal and vegetable. New note added. There's a poster with a list of recipes for animals in the cauldron. Okay, that's handy, because I had to go to the thing before. Return to the hub and activate the supply lever. He said meat was coming, right? Huh? Is that not the- where's the meat lever? Is it this? No, that's recycling. Wait, there's a lever for each of these, but only one for these? Oh, there you go. Oh my god! Oh my god! That's how you're getting your meat? Dude! Hello? 
Damn. I, I mean, at Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Don't worry, Paul. It's me again. How's it going? Do you need any explanations? Several! Oh, I definitely do. I thought you had beef or, uh, I don't know, lamb in the fridge. And there... And there's a long-necked pig. You see, Paul, dozens of parasites spread from the mother every day. They infiltrate our animals and they turn into... How shall I put it? Well, monsters. And they have specific tastes. They need meat. What the... What the hell is the mother? <laughs> Relax. Oh. The mother is securely locked away. Not much is known about her, so they study her. Forget about it. You know your tasks. Don't worry about the rest. Fuck! I gave a piece of meat to my wife. You did what? I did. <laughs> Sorry, Paul. But it's really ridiculous. Life gives you a chance to become a worthy, well-off person, and you take the easy way. Descending to simple theft. There won't be any more indulgence. So if they say grind bodies, you grind. They'll say kill, you kill. Got it? Got it. Just tell me where my phone is. I'll call Lily. Maybe she and Gina haven't eaten yet. I won't allow it, chum. If you call your wife, it'll be a direct violation of the NDA. No, Paul, you won't drag me into this. You'll have to fully feel the consequences of your misdeed. And now stop whining and go to work. Fuck, dude! You wanna kill people? The game had like a nudity filter, and it said, do you wanna turn nudity off? And I was like, yeah, I'm not really sure if it'll get annoying with the YouTube video if I don't, and then editors have to censor. But I was like, why would I need a nudity filter in a game about animals? Now I get it. Are you alive? <laughs> yes, yes, very alive. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh my god! Mmm, meat bricks. <laughs> That's so fucked. He didn't even- I thought he was gonna say something like, Don't worry, Paul, they're prisoners or they're bad people or she murdered someone out in the real world. But no, we're straight up murdering people. That makes sense now why there's no meat lever. Oh my god, that's so fucked. I've given you access to the recipes for the infected specimens in the kitchen factory. Feed them. I've given you access to the recipe, okay. Giraffe station storage room. Gorilla station storage room, penguin. CJ's locker, 1768. Yeah, if there's no lab, then there's no lockers, right? Feed the infected animal. What is the infected animal? Hold on, let me look around here first. One of these lockers? CJ locker? Oh, he puts it in himself. What are we gonna find? Floppy disk. You access added. The floppy disk access or data has been accessed. Okay, well, how do I do it? CJ Summers, Experiment 23. Testing experimental meds on mutated specimens. They don't work during the frustration phase. The pathological cell division process must be completed. In other words, the organism must fully mutate. Access to experimental drugs is located at the vet station. Huh. Can I access this yet? I don't think I'll ever be able to access that. That might be the end of the game. Can I puke in here? Over the misdeeds that I've done? Can I see myself in the mirror so I can see what kind of monster I've become? Can I shoot myself with the dart? Maybe I'll just make coffee. <laughs> uh, let me put this gun back, actually. Dude, this game is way more messed up than I expected it to be. Okay, wait. You said... The infected animal. I don't know what that means. 
Okay, so we have the wallabies, which is the kangaroos. Oh, that's cool. So if all f if they had like three symptoms, I could do that and then it whittles it down. Cool. I guess I can just go to the next animal. What do wallabies eat? Uh, two herbal and one vegetable. Okay, so the same as the giraffes. I feel like I'm gonna get this food thing wrong every single time. Unless it's like half, then I'm gonna fuck it up every time. Okay, wallabies. So I need meat to feed the infected giraffe. I'll do that next. Can I just... I don't have to bring it back every time. I was hoping I could just bring the food to this. I needed three and I got three! I fucking nailed it! Okay, I have a total weight of 1.7. I need to cut off 1.5, so shouldn't that be like this? Yeah, okay. Got it, and meat. I have three and I need two, so... Like that? What's a third? One, two... Here. Nice! Okay. Fucking nailed it that time. I cut off two and I needed two. I almost nailed that! 100%! I'm only 5% off total. Okay, I need to. They have Serpericondalus. I can fix that. Okay, to the giraffe enclosure. Again. So is my whole thing that I'm trying to keep that stuff at bay? Is there a fail state? If they mutate too much, can I die and then have to restart a section? I don't know how this works. I thought the game would be split up into days. I don't know why I thought that. Okay. Gadget trolley. Yeah, that makes sense now. So you are cutting off the food into this. And then that comes out there and it gets minced into the bucket. That was probably clear in the beginning when I was doing it, but... I don't know, I, I was very confused. I guess you can just cut off a piece, then let it go through, and then cut off another piece, and then let that, let that go through, instead of cutting too much too early. Right? Also, I do not trust John Goodman. The doc? Not at all. What's in the giraffe storage? I like this PDA thing that I have. Another phone. Okay. That's it? Oh, nice. Any other chemicals lying around that I can have? No. That's fine, that's fine. ASSA, Animal Sound Spectrum Analyzer, as I call it. <laughs> a saw, dude. Come closer to the animals. Start spectrum recording. Wait until the data is recorded. Okay, I did that. I just didn't find anything weird about it last time. Welcome to the giraffe enclosure. Open enclosure. How do I know which animal is infected? Is it the sick one? Okay, now you're both lying down, so that's confusing. I'm weirded out, man. Am I supposed to just put this down and feed you and then... Oh. Whoever eats it is... cured? I'll see if it gives me a task complete then. I guess. Who's hungry for nom nom human? You are, yeah. You're really hung, no, okay. Bo is afraid to eat. 
Wait, does it... Oh, I thought it meant that one of the giraffes was infected. Is that just telling me that if they get infected, that's what you feed them? Because if that's the case, then I just fucking wasted a whole bunch of stuff. I don't think I needed to be here at all. God damn it. Okay, heading out. Yeah, it says I've cured all the animals, so I didn't actually have to do anything in here. Fuck! I should have just gone to the wallabies like I wanted to. I should have just gone to see the bounce bounce giant guys. All right, wallaby time! I got the right food. I barely deviated from the planned amount. All right. Which is good, I'm getting better. I'm getting better. This feels like the first time I played Pacific Drive and I had no idea what the fuck I was doing. And then that game got a little bit overwhelming and I didn't really like it, so <laughs> I stopped. This is cool though. I like this. Taking it in like smaller chunks at a time. The vet gun. Load the gun with the right- yeah, I know how to use that already. Blood syringe. Close to the animal when it's immobile, collecting blood samples. Put samples in the blood collector. Yeah, I did that fairly right last time then. What do we have in here? A new PDA. Anthony Hopwood. When they turn, the meat can calm them down. Yeah, see, that's what I messed up. I had to wait for them to mutate and it probably told me that too. Ooh, nice. Ooh. There's a lot to collect here. Fuck yeah. Which makes me feel like someone's very sick in here, that I have to make some complex shit. Another PDA. I finally found a way to cure that damn mutant with the experimental meds. I found access on some CJ's PDA. Looks like he's an important dude around here. Gave the mutant an injection of Toxicus Feralis. And this shit really worked. Awesome news. And by the way, it seems mutants can mimic different diseases. I'll keep an eye on it. That makes my job infinitely harder. I don't know how to cure the simple ones. How am I going to cure the mimicky ones? Okay, let's go see these Kangaskhans. Hey, Sally, Amy, Wally, and Penny. That's cute names. Cute names? Who? Okay. Okay, chill the fuck out. Chill the beans. All right, chill out. I'm going over here now. Don't attack me, mutant weirdos. Here you go, take the food and go! Take the food and go. I don't, I don't want to know about it. You all better enjoy this, because I, I sweated over a cold stove for this. Sally, what's going on? Sally, you don't want nom noms? Maybe you need one of them to leave? There you go. Are you happy or are you fucked in the head? I don't know what's happening. Maybe if I collect your poop, I'll know more. I think they're infected as all hell. I think these guys are getting ready to kill me. Dude, it would be so efficient if, as a person, you could just eat and poop immediately. Any other poop elsewhere? Did I get it all? I think I did. How do I switch to the other thing? I have, like, two things in my inventory right now. Ah! Like that. So I can get this as well, just in case I find more poop later. I'll keep the other one. Okay, Amy. Let's see about you. 38.8, you're gonna be just fine, Amy. You're gonna be just fine. Oh, perfect. Perfect little family. Look at this picture. Look at this beautiful family portrait, Penny. Star. Okay, I can't do it from there for some reason. Be cool if I could get all three at once. I should be able to. 
Usala, you're a little high, but you're not red, so I think we're fine. Why does it not say poop? For, like, done. Oh, because I haven't... I haven't brought it back yet. I didn't miss any, did I? Who knows where you guys are shitting. Okay, that's fine for now. Put the poop scoop back. Put this guy back. Now I gotta listen to you. I don't know what the UV flashlight does yet. No! Put it back! Blood syringe. I don't know if that's how kangaroos are supposed to act. There you go. Easy. Easy does it. Nice. Okay, that's Amy done. It's nice when there's only four of them. Hey, don't go in there! Whoa, whoa, whoa. When it was the penguins, I didn't have a clue who I had gotten already. Is this Penny? Okay, Amy and Penny done. You guys sound so fucked up! Okay, I can't get these for some reason. Oh, they have to be standing still! Ow! Oh, it's all starting to make sense! My brain is working! Okay, so who did I have left to collect? I think it was... Oh, fuck. I don't know. I got Amy and Penny. I think I just got Wally, so I think it's Sally that I've left to do. No, no, no. Come back. Come back. Why are you guys so weird? Stop! Stop in the name of the zoo! You need to get checked! I did like that idea, though. He said that the mother's... The, the mother sends out parasites towards the rest of the zoo. So there's some, like main big creature somewhere? That's cool. Um, okay. Blood's collected. I didn't check your sound. Oh, this screen didn't show up last time. I don't know what that means. 97 point- oh, there's the other poop. Okay. Task complete. Okay, I need another poop to go collect. Maybe I didn't get all the poop last time. I like this. I like taking care of my animals. I mean, it's going to get horrifying at some point, but... Right now, it's easy. Now, is that all the poop? There's four animals and I got four poops. So that's good. I think that should be fine. What else did I need to check on them? Oh, I think that's it. I just need to go back and deposit this stuff and see if there's anything wrong with them. I'm telling you, my kangaroos are all fucked. I have never heard a kangaroo make noise before. I feel like all the videos I've seen of kangaroos online, they're just fighting dogs and Australian dudes. I feel like I haven't learned enough. So is that the parasite then? That I can get out of them? <laughs> Fucking shit sucker. Task is complete. Heal the animals. Okay, well I have to put the blood in first, don't I? Do I just put in one? I realized that you just put it in once. Last time I put in like five and it doesn't do anything different. Yes! Cool, I did it all perfectly this time. Good job, me. Okay, what is wrong with my guys? Sally, you've got a- you've got a poop and a blood, which means that you have ulcerative colitis. Uh. 
Yeah. A poop and a blood. Ulcerative colitis is an inflammation of the colon and rectum, causing abdominal pain and diarrhea and rectal bleeding. Don't I know all about it? Erlevax. Antimicrobial substance for the treatment of infections caused by the bacterium. Okay. Probiotic based substance for gastrointestinal normalization. That's good, right? I, should I make two? Because two of them had issues. Did, did that give me two? No, give me one. Oh, there you go. I can still hear them going Aah! in the background. Okay, time to go fix those poopers. Excuse me? What? The fuck? Holy shit! Okay. Okay, what do we do to him? Okay, hold on. You need to be fixed. <laughs> I need to fix my guys first. Oh, this is fucking bad. Oh, God. Do I need to give him the meat? Task has failed. Rescue the penny. Oh, God! Do I need- do I need to kill him? What do I do? What do I do? Close the enclosure. It doesn't fucking matter. What do I do? I haven't been trained for this! Rescue the Sally. It just killed Penny. Handled the mutant Macromaribicus wallaby. I didn't bring any meat with me. I I can't. I can't make it. I I can't. I just I gotta kill. I gotta shoot to kill. I think. But I think I need three of them. Okay, there's two- two of them are fucked. Actually, maybe I don't need a lethal injection at all. Maybe I actually just can... Maybe there's a macro something that I can do? Anti-inflammatory substance reduces animal activity, inducing relaxation and sleep. Antihistamine? I don't think it fucking matters. I- th okay. Guys, I just gotta go for it. I just gotta go for it. The guy did say it took three shots to take it down. I think that's what it's training me for. Don't kill my other kangaroos! Oh, Penny, no! Where'd they go? Oh! Put another one in. Put another one in. Do I have to go into my inventory every time to do that? Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay, I can just press R to reload. Okay, got it, got it. Whoa! Oh shit! Get out of it! Oh, okay! Oh god! Where'd he go? Kill his ass! He just vanished. I can still hear him. Oh, Penny, you got scars all over you. Does that mean I have to treat that? Are you? You're not going to turn into something, are you? Oh. Whoa. How do I? What do I do to get that? I need an adult! This is so confusing. Oh my god, what do I do? I need to keep track of how much the animal sleeps. Excessive sleep is a sign of illness. Oh my god, there's so many fucking things to take care of. Rescue the animals. Okay, I did it. Check the wallaby enclosure. You guys good? I'm so sorry you had to see that. 
It's highlighted, but I don't know what I can do to get it. <laughs> oh, Benny. It feels so bad. Maybe I can suck the parasite out with the sucky thing? Because it's a bio sucker. Or at least... On this thing, it shows that I can put it in there as well. So maybe it'll work to grab that? I don't know, I can try at least. I want to see what else would work. And it's yellow like the poop. Yeah! Oh my god, that's so creepy looking. He's got a... a mouth belly! Holy fuck! That went from zero to a thousand instantly! I mean, at least there's less... kangaroos to take care of. <laughs> less wallabies. Holy fuck. Because I was like, I wonder what it's like when one of them transforms. Will I notice? <laughs> that was a full-on boss fight. I think I did the right thing, right? I think I handled that the way I was supposed to. Check the wallaby enclosure. It's showing a thing over there. I can't get to that. That's in a completely different area. Can I close it now? Oh, gastroguard. An antiprotozole, an antimicrobial substance for the treatment of ulcerative colitis. Well, now I don't have enough for it because I wasted some on the other thing. Which is annoying, so I can only heal one of them. I didn't realize there was a massive list of darts that you could make. That's why it didn't work before. Oh god, I can't miss with this. So you're healed now, but... I can't help the other guy. I don't have enough materials. Oh, maybe I can... Oh, wait. I can actually go back to my hub and get them. I thought stuff that was gastrointestinal would have also been... Like a probiotic for ulcerative colitis. I've had colon problems before that they thought was ulcerative colitis and I was given probiotics to try and, like, get my gut microbiome back to a shape. But I didn't realize it would just say exactly, like, this is for ulcerative colitis. Um... There was a thing here. I think that yellow one was the one I needed. Um... Gastrogard for ulcerative colitis. Oh my god, now I have tons! Okay. Nice. Now we can fix it. Because it said check the wallaby enclosure, but I didn't realize if you click into it, it says heal the animals. I was like, oh, maybe it didn't heal them because I was in the middle of a boss fight and it didn't count. But it turns out I made them enormously more ill. I'm coming, buddies. Don't you worry. None of you guys are going to get infected. Even though you're probably already infected. Is that why you guys are all acting weird? Ha-ha! You're safe, Wally! Now go sleep next to your two dead friends. Oh my god, who knew that the wallaby enclosure would be where things got so difficult for me? Nice. Can I close it? I don't think I can ever close the wallaby enclosure again because the door is broken. <laughs> yeah, that'll do it all right. Oh god. I am incredibly infected. I don't think I'm going to make it out of here. Whoa, I won't. Oh, I was stuck in shift. I thought I was just running really fast because I was so ill. Alright, next up, 
gorilla time! Oh no. Oh no. Just get it over with. Oh, nice to meet you! Oh no! I didn't mean it like that! Nice to meet you? It was nice to make your acquaintance, is what I meant. How do I clean the bio waste filter? Oh. Ew, ew, ew! There's a fucking hand in it! Is it done? Is it free of waste now? <laughs> I'm gonna go look at the gorillas. I'm not gonna feed them straight away. Maybe that's the tactic, to get in. Suss out the situation first. Then get, then give gorilla what it need. Send out the gadget trolley. I guess I don't need to send it out. I can just take stuff off and bring it with me here. I don't know, I might need it actually to unlock the door. I'm sorry, animals. I'm sure I can rescue all of you and we'll all have a good time and everything will be fun, but I'm bad at my job. Plus, I'm all infected. Oh god, this goes downstairs. Nice. Oh, I don't have to mess with power, do I? Anthony Hopwood, what are you saying, Anthony? Damn, something strange is happening to me. An overwhelming urge to eat this raw meat. My hand grabbed a piece on its own and I devoured it almost instantly without chewing. That sweet taste in my mouth. That's what's happening to me! I'm turning into gorilla! I return to monkey! Return to monk! I want meat! Saw something. Oh, Redix. Hey, don't kill me! Gorillas are fucking terrifying. Let's take these. They can just measure your temperature straight away. You're all gonna fucking hang out by the door in the beginning? Oh, Dexter. That's a cute name. Where are they at? Oh, Thor! That's a sick name for a gorilla. One of you don't sound right. One of you does not sound good. Is your name Pepper? You okay, Pepper? No. No. You're too hot! Okay, how many gorillas are in here? I don't know why I assumed four, but I can just see here. Yeah, four. Chief! Uh, no, 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 no! My bad, my bad, my bad! I'm coming back! No, I'm coming back! Don't worry, guys! I'll feed you eventually! Where's Chief? There you are, Chief. Damn it. Ah, uh, see, this is why it's good to test. Come here! You little fucking bitches. Oh, the sound is off as well. Sound is off on both of you. As if I couldn't tell already. <laughs> You're fine. Where'd the other one go? Who am I missing? You. Thor. Oh, you don't like that. Never mind. We're fine. Okay. So I figured some things out. To take your blood while I can. Okay, we got Dexter. Hey, <laughs> how's it going? 
Dexter J chilling. Settle down, Chief. Okay, we got Dexter, we got Chief. Hold on, don't mind me. I would hate to do that to a gorilla. That's fucking terrifying. Okay, Dexter and Chief are done. Thor is puking his fucking ring up. What's wrong with you? Stop! Okay, I need pepper as well. Thor's not standing still for anything! Come here! Let me see if I can get pepper. Where are you at, Pep? Oh, nice. Go to sleep and good night. I will steal your fucking blood. Don't kill me, fucking please. Who are you? Where's Thor? Yes, yes, standing still. No, for the love of God, Thor. I need to know if something's wrong with you. Will you settle down? Look at that little booty hole go. <laughs> yes. Okay. Got them all. Now I need to uh, exit and go back. Actually, no. I can feed you guys now, actually. Then suck up the poop. Uh, put you down. I wonder if I can get upgrades. Oh no, I didn't even make the food. What am I talking about? Hold on. I'll be back! Because I was like, I'll give them their food and then I'll figure out what's wrong with them, but... Like, I could go and make some syringes and some serums right now, but... If I don't know what's wrong with them... Like, what if they have a gastrointestinal thing as well and I make the wrong one? I need to be sure. To be sure, to be sure! Well, hopefully one of them doesn't fucking... Go crazy and turn into a mutant while I'm out here. Sounds so fucking gross. Okay, go to the. You need one kilo off seven. That? Oh! Fucking bang on! Holy shit! I'm good at this. Five point six. So that's. It's just 2.5 and 2.5 is the full 5, so the extra 0.6 is like this, so I want to go... Oh, 2.6! Holy shit, I'm good at that! Holy shit, I'm good! Let's fucking go! Damn! From the beginning being like, I don't know if I can do this properly. I'm gonna get it wrong every time. Bang on, baby! I don't know if any of you can actually transform in the middle of this, if it's like a timed thing. Or if it's all like... At certain times that it, like it happens every time. Okay, no one has a blood disease. Here you go, guys! Nom nom! Nom nom slop! Come get y'all slop! Attaboy, Dexter. You showed him how it's done. <laughs> Sauntering over like a horse. I mean, you are sick. So that makes sense. Now squeeze out a duker. Puking! The food is perfect! Fuck you! I mean, you are sick. Ew, ew. <laughs> oh, 
caught it in action. Okay, is he eating anyway? I think he just needed a break to get sick for a little second. Why do you all act like that? Chief is sick, but you're not. Okay, show me those bum holes. Don't you fucking dare! I fucking slaved over a stove for that! How dare you! Yeah, that's right, Chief. Chief is sick, and even he knows what it's like to poop properly. Oh, you pooped anyway. Good. Maybe you're just actually sick. Maybe I'll get his poop and realize that he's very sick. Okay. Now Pepper. Pepper the pooper. I just need one little dukesters out of you and we're good to go. And then gorillas are saved. Since I healed the giraffes though, does that mean they're healed forever? Like now they can't mutate? I don't know how it works. Hold on, I just got a poop scoop. All right, lads. Fair play, stop getting sick. I'll be back. I don't know the best order to do this in yet. Hopefully those are the only two that are sick though. Take my poop! Oh, I'm sick. I need an injection. Okay, what do we got? Diagnose those apes! Okay. Nice. So, you have temperature and noise, which means that you have meningitis! Inflammation of the membranes of the brain and spinal cord caused by an infection. Damn, Chief and Pepper got meningitis. Okay, what fixes meningitis? There it is, meningitis. Redix, chemical, and phyto. Hmm. Neuromed. Or neuromend. Give me two of those. Cool. Away we go. Time to save some monkeys. Fuck me! Holy shit! I, like, I don't know what to do in this scenario. All I'm doing is killing my fucking dudes. Should I tranquilize them? I'm killing them. <laughs> I don't know what to do yet. Fuck me. Okay, put the, the, the pooper back. Like, if I had gone in with something else first, would I have been better off? If I'd gone in with the meat early? I don't know. Where is he? Oh. Oh, he's so big. Holy shit! Did I get him? I don't think that counted. I think as I shot, he vanished at the same time. God damn it. That time I got you. It's putting the Neuromend in. Ah, oh, shit. I shot him with the wrong ones! Please tell me I can make some new- some more Neuromend after this. Oh my god, fucking terrifying. Where'd you go? Okay, there's one. Good, good, good. Why is it darkness? Why darkness? Where you at? Oh my god, you fucking freak. Oh. There's another one. I can't see anything. Ah, ah, okay, okay, get off me! Holy fuck! I need to leave. I need to leave. 
I need to leave because I need to make another injection. God fucking damn it. Uh, and I need to make another Neuromend at the same time. I need a fucking Neurofin. This is so stressful. Like, could I have prevented that? I don't know. Because if I give them, I, well, my brain is assuming that I can't give them food. I can't give them food that has meat in it unless they are infected. But maybe I can just preemptively give them meat every time, like the other monkeys will eat it anyway. I don't fucking know. Okay, we good. We good. We good. Yeah, it's not the ones that are even sick. Maybe this is just something that needs to happen. Oh, it's so fucking stressful. Oh my god. Sorry, monkey. Sorry, friend. Now oh, there's two things over there. What does that mean? <laughs> I am dying a very, very fast death. Maybe I can't even rescue the animals. I'm just assuming I can, because the name of the game is Zucosis Rescue the Animals. Technically, I rescued them. Technically, there's still three alive! R.I.P. that kangaroo that I failed. But technically... I'm rescuing some other ones. I rescued him from an infectious life. I don't know. I'm gonna be so mad if... When the game comes out, I watch other people's playthroughs and then... It's so obvious how to fix things. And I'm like, well... Nobody's played the game yet. <laughs> Brought all that meat with me for nothing. I'm all, I also don't know if I make food with meat in it now. Does that, like, as he was infected and I put that in the thing, would that have calmed him down? Because I don't have enough to make that. Oh, I do. I could have made something like that. So if I had made that as he was infected, and then put it in the trough, would that have saved him? Would he have gone back to normal? Maybe we can try that with the next one. Maybe I don't have to kill all of my animals. I also did all of these. I don't have zebra, moose, hippopotamus, or elephant. Maybe if we go back to the hub, I get more unlocked. Hey, Paul. Oh. Are you here? Lily, no! Lily, did you oh, eat the meat? The meat you gave me was incredibly delicious. <clears throat> Gina had three servings. Uh, no! Take the rest to her beloved daddy. No! Oh, someone arrived. Hello. Do you work here? Hey, what are you doing? Let me go! <laughs> Is that John Goodman? You son of a bitch! Good morning, Paul. How was your night? It's time to feed the mother. Oh. Wake up, Paul. Mother likes her food to flutter and squeak. Don't worry about your wife. I think she'll make a great dessert. Really, Paul, you didn't think that after everything you've seen, I'd let you go? Uh-oh, looks like Mommy is particularly hungry. Wait, did I fail? Goodbye, Paul. Tell Mother. Bon appetit. <laughs> In loving memory of Alex Alexander Dagan, the screenwriter of Zucosis and our dear friend from all of us at Clapperheads. Oh no. I failed. Okay, I guess I got to figure out how to not die like that. That's crazy. I thought it was going to be like, oh, my wife got there. We were going to move on. Oh, it's time to feed the mother and then I would see it and then it would give me the rest of the animals to help. This is all under the speculation that I was like, okay, I have meat, I can feed it to the animals to satiate them. But I thought, if they're not 
changed already, then I can't feed them. Like, they won't accept the food because it has meat in it. But maybe I could have done that anyway. I should have tried to feed them the meat after they got infected this time, but I didn't think I had enough stuff. I'm trying to explain where my brain is at and why I failed to do that. Oh. A new animal is available because I failed? Was that supposed to happen? Oh, this is blowing the doors off this completely. He is hauling ass out of here. I didn't hear that the first time. Okay. Check the, the enclosure, feed the animals. Yeah, so... Hmm. I wonder if there's anything different I can do. Well, I leave this here then. I had intended to do the whole thing at once, but if there's, there's, it seems like there's way more to this than I expected the first time around. But I'm curious to see how deep this game goes, and I think it's worth doing multiple episodes on. But that's gonna do it for me for now. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.